We make no apologies by starting today's program by paying tribute to our good friend, Paul Mariner, who passed away today at the age of 68. What's been striking, what's been emotional, what's been overwhelming over the last 24 hours is that everyone who seems to have met Paul, known Paul, been lucky enough to call Paul a friend, has the same thing to say about him. As great of a contribution he made on the pitch, it was off the pitch where you really met the legend that is Paul Mariner. We'll start with the football bits. We'll start with the fact that he started at Plymouth Argyle. That was his first real professional contract back in 1973. At Ipswich is where he really made his name. So much success at the Tractor Boys. Then now he made that big move to Arsenal. And let's not forget his contribution to England. He scored the goal that saw them qualify for the World Cup in 1982. Taking a look at his resume, it's impressive. Fours for England, he played in the World Cup in 82 and the Euros in 1980, scoring 13 goals in 35 appearances. Ipswich is really where his status is legendary on the pitch. So many Ipswich fans have told me that they had posters of him on their bedroom growing up. A key part of their success winning the FA Cup and the UEFA Cup under Bobby Robson. After he, start, after he finished playing, obviously then it was about his managerial career. He was an assistant at New England Revolution, and that's where he settled in Boston and where he started to get us to know us here at ESPN, where he joined the ESPN FC family, and where he became, well, our mate. Your Halloween? Me? Yeah. No. <laughs> Surprise. Lights off. What do you mean? You're not, you got all dressed up and you're not going out. <laughs> oh, <laughs> most exciting game you're ever involved in? England, Hungary at Wembley. We won 1 0. Who scored the goal? Um, let me think. Me. Yeah! yeah. Well, because of my nimble feet, I just. <laughs> that's, your, that's your hand. Yeah. It's better to be great at something rather than wear some hideous blazer on the television. You don't like his jacket, do you? No, I don't. <laughs> When you put that, that T-shirt on, whatever it is, with that jacket. It's OK. That's not your game. Well, well done, show us, so. Just show us how, how you text again. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a big phone. Paul Mariner's uh, yes. 17th, 49th birthday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, chocolate, birthday mousse. chocolate mousse. Whoa! What? Come on. <laughs> Let's hey, get hey, to hey, it. Hey, 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 get your hands off of that. <laughs> you know it. You, you know it. And you, you love, love it. it. Yeah. Some weather here on the East Coast, hasn't it? But fear not, Paul Mariner is well prepared. <laughs> Hit them up for, look at these. What's wrong with well, them? Look at that. You're ready for the snow and the rain. I'm, I'm exactly. ready for it all. Well. Uh, and the beach. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <But> you can. <laughs> Go, put your trumpet back in your, in your case. Show everyone what your trumpet looked like again. <laughs> right. That's, that's a trombone. Well, a trombone, whatever. <laughs> that is a brilliant picture. That is geography teacher. Who is about that? to retire. Is it the... Which no, is? why have you got three Maras? Now Deli Ali's come up with a 2.0 oh, version. It. That's kind of it, don't? Yeah, but you're yeah. very ambidextrous, aren't you? I mean... My, I don't know if Maras <laughs> quite knows what ambidextrous. Sweden will win it. 1-0. Wow, he's very confident, isn't he? What? Uh, hey, he's wrong, but he's confident. <laughs> <laughs> he said, I've had to go and buy a new mower, which kills him, right? I said, what's the matter then? He said, well, right. I can't get it to go in the bag. I said, well, get the rule book out. I mean, go on, on the internet, put, you know. Instructions. Oh, the instructions. So it wouldn't be a rule book. Could... <laughs> <laughs> get the rule book. <laughs> you know, what's the rules, right? Best striker in the world, Paul, you're a striker. Harry Kane. Really? Oh, my goodness. All right, Fred Flintstone. Look, <laughs> whatever name I come up with, you give me a custard pie right in the mush. What a sick moment for Rooney. Sick? Oh, sick? Yeah. Because I, I, I thought it was That's fantastic. That's great young rhetoric yeah. for you, isn't it? You bloody hypocrite. You sat there five minutes ago when we were off here. You went, yeah, he's just doing his job, isn't he? Well, he's doing his job. Now you've got it as the greatest goal this century. If he does that with that group, then he, he needs knighting. The Queen needs to knight that guy because... <laughs> well, well, I'm not sure if the Queen can knight someone in Argentina. You see my form about the number of... What are those things called? That apps. Are on, those apps, right? <laughs> All those things are on it. I've got enough of those things on Right. I don't want any more on it. OK. And yeah. then what, what sort of a viewer are you? Yeah, I get uh, all tingly and nervous and sweaty. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so you got the tingles. The, when, do, when do they start? National anthem? Feet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
What right. do we think of Paul's tie today? I, yeah, what, 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 little... What's going on with it? Just because you're brave today with your pink shirt on. No, well, no, what's, it, what's the inside normally the inside? Oh, oh look at this. It's, it's my sharks, Is that them? piranhas? Oh, look. Whatever, you're the expert on fishing. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, one week to go until the World Cup starts. Huh? What? I'm ready. <laughs> you're not playing. Which stadium's atmosphere annoyed you the most? When Stephen and I were I was just thinking about, are you going to say Chicago? Yes. <laughs> I was just waiting to see. You never like going to Chicago? With Clements and Peter Shilton. Where are you looking? No, if where, you, where are you looking? I'm looking into the sky look because I'm just, I'm just look waxing. At, look, look at the number one. Go to Paul's camera and the number one I goes didn't even know, I didn't even know that was my camera. <laughs> my name's not Dan no, Thomas. He, listen, he didn't even know it was a camera. <laughs> no, I didn't. Take your glasses off. <laughs> look at, look, well, look at oh, the camera. No. <laughs> Put Paul. me light on. How's it going, everybody? Oh, you've got your filthy mitts all over me glasses now. Which camera should we say goodbye to Gab on? Oh, there it is, the red one. Where is he? There. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.